I'm receiving another message from Uncle Albert. Uh-oh, here we go. <laughs> Nephew Shaggy, Scooby-Doo. Dr. Five's agents must not be allowed to reach the North Pole if the device they are carrying is detonated at precisely sundown. It will destroy all electronics across the world, putting an end to civilization as we know it, and eliminating every modern convenience, including... And I hate to break this to you. Video games. <gasps> oh, oh, no! The end of video games? Like this is the worst crisis ever! We gotta find those agents and stop them! Dr. Speed! Found them. He's got more evil than you'll ever need! Dr. My theme song. This is so exciting, I simply must have a picture. Say cheese. Big smile. They're right behind us. Stay cool. Huzzah! Dr. Speed, Asphalt Warrior! Feel my wrath. <laughs> How was that for cool, huh? Oh, that was great. Very cool. Oh, 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 my leotard's riding up. Oh, not cool. Not cool! Oh. Control! Uh-oh! Airborne! Airborne! Hello, Penguin. Transform! I don't see them anywhere. Looks like we lost them, Scoob. Target acquired. Launch sequence initiated. There is something one doesn't see every day. <laughs> This place is empty. You ask for a sarsaparilla, and all you get is a glass of spider webs. Zoinks! What's that? I'll bet it's the outer space ghost. That's it. That's it. I'm staying right here. Ringo. Okay. If you want to stay here alone. <laughs> I guess this is Swamp's Inn. I don't know where it is, but I'm sure glad we found it. Well, I'd like to know more about that zombie. This sure looks like the place where you can find out. Yes, sirree. As strange as it may seem, I've seen the zombie you speak of and the old witch that brought him to life with her voodoo magic. Huh? <laughs> You mean there's a witch living in that swamp, too? Yep. She showed up about six months ago. Me and my partner, Zeb, went into the swamp to do some frog hunting. We heard a strange noise. And that's when we saw it. Smoke of darkness, demon of evil, take the form of the living. And come forth from the flame! And if 
ever since then, no one's ever dared to go into the swamp. Like, wow! No wonder this town is deserted. <laughs> like, wow! We always find the scariest things. But there's no use being scared on an empty stomach. Have a peanut. Take two, they're small. <laughs> Well, okay, wise guy. Let's see you try that one again. Just try it. <laughs> so it's the ghost. Glad we've seen the last of that creeper. Hey, Bill. The creeper! Joinks, it's him! Paper! Paper! Back to the barn! Here we go again! Don't let him get that paper! Paper! Uh-oh, wrong turn. You wouldn't hit somebody with glasses on, would you? Ah! Side. Now we've got you! Doc! <laughs> oh no! Scooby Goo! I want Goof him! Got it! And we got them! Yay! What a creaky! Place. Hey, Scooby, come on! Hello, oh, wait for me! <laughs> it's lucky for you, the room's empty. Let's get back to the others. <laughs> He's got me! a tree branch. I knew it all the time. <laughs> hey, like where's Scooby-Doo? He's supposed to be helping me. He went surfing. Thank you. 
You're very good. Are you a puppet master? Oh, my no. I just fiddle with them as a hobby. You're okay with me, Pop. <laughs> <laughs> well, you certainly seem professional. Well, why not? The great Pietro has helped me. How long am I? Hey, what's with him? Yeah, what's with you, Scooby-Doo? A witch? A witch? I get it. Uh, one of the puppets scared you. Okay, let me up. What a spooky place. Not now, Scooby. Not now. I feel better already. Me too, Scoob. This spread is a... Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I am so scared. Me <laughs> <I> too. <laughs> Unless aliens can jump really high. Can aliens jump really high? Right? That's so cool. You probably have a huge following on the internet. Have your own blog? But it wasn't around back then. Heck, I don't think there were even computers back then. <laughs> ah, we should have left them in the ice. I still can't feel my fingers. Oh, what's that? Condensation, probably from the air vents. Looks like alien juice to me. And you've seen alien juice before? No, not exactly. But if I were to take a guess at what it looked like, I would say it would look a lot like that. Could this day get any worse? <laughs> what the blazes is going on? Alien! Big! <laughs> Chasing us! It hates food and likes melting brains! Maybe it's lost. Or maybe it doesn't exist. Wait, where did you see an alien? Dude, restaurant! And you left before you were done eating? Uh-huh. Shaggy and Scooby would never leave food behind. Something was in that restaurant. And that's the truth! So help me hot dogs. Okay, let's go take a look. Oh, sure, why not? I could use a good laugh. That's the lost town of missionaries that disappeared about 300 years ago. When did you guys find this? I don't know, a while ago? Never ran into any missionaries, though. Just robots! Dumb old German robots! Some say the missionaries' disappearance was the beginning of the curse of Crystal Cove. Like robots and curses? <laughs> no, thanks! Which button takes us home? Forget it, guys. My mystery sense is totally tingling. We gotta take a closer look at that town right now. <laughs> Fred, 
Look at all those holes. Yeah. Looks like somebody's been digging. I think we just found out where the missionaries went. Yeah, out for seafood. Like, <laughs> it's a shame they finished dinner. Shaggy, the food would be 300 years old. Mm -hmm. Let's check the cupboards. Pickled eggs! Pickled ham hocks! Pickled! Pickled! Stop a box! Swim! We can't outswim them, they're too fast! Tom! Tom! We need help! shot of the day, the magic hour. We'll start up the weather machine and have the zombies attack. All you have to do is run the other way, okay? Mm -hmm. Run! 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 Shaggy! Yeah. <laughs> it's just a cat, Scoob. Nothing to be worried about. I know I should be freaking out, but this is adding some serious production value to the picture. The last ferry leaves at dusk. If we hurry, we can get on it and get off the island. Come on! Oh. 
<laughs> like we made it, Scoob. We're on the ground. The sweet, sweet ground. <laughs> What do you think you're doing, eh? Trying to sneak into my boneyard while my back was turned? I think our disguises have lost their charm. <laughs> oh, a couple of wiseacres, eh? Believe me, laddies, you don't want to see my bad side. <laughs> Like this being your bad side? Time for a late night snack. Like, hold on. You wouldn't eat a fellow werewolf, would you? Huh? Observe. <laughs> <laughs> Stone me. It's one of my own brethren. Come on, then. Come on. Sorry about the rough reception, mate. Gotta keep out of... Jinkies, it's like this Ivala barely exists. Bingo. His real name is Count Ivalo von Meanskrieg. Looks like Count Ivalo applied for a work permit, but was denied. Because his aptitude test showed he was pure evil. I gotta tell the gang. Hey, look, there's a page marked. It's them. The kids are disappeared. Check out the caption. Brad Childs, Ricky Owens, Cassidy Williams, Judy Reeves, and mascot Professor Pericles. Crystal Cove High's Mystery Solvers Club. Mystery Incorporated. Wow, I like that name. Like, these kids were just like us. Question is, why did they disappear? We heard explosions. Are you okay? Oh, what have you done to our cemetery? What we've done is capture the graveyard ghoul. And now let's see who he really is. Evalo. Well, what do you know? It really was the most obvious suspect. <laughs> who would have guessed? Evala was stealing natural gas from the Crystal Cove Gas Company. Yes, that is right. I did it. I, Count Evalo von Meanskrieg, developed a perfectly evil plan and used my position as gravedigger to cover my activities. But the crowds from the mayor's movie night meant someone might notice what I was up to. I had to scare them off. Thus, my genius evil plan of the graveyard ghoul was born. Unfortunately, the flame broiling grill was incredibly dangerous so close to my gas lines. I had to stop it, which led to my capture. Sadly, I, the evil Count Ivalo von Meanskrieg, would have gotten away with it too, if it wasn't for the sheriff and his American style barbecue. so nervous. Don't sweat it, Daph. You'll do great. Mm -hmm. You think so? Yeah. Driving tests are easy. Even I pass mine. Oh, me too. Daphne, you're gonna be great. I believe in you. We all do. Yeah. yeah. If you put your mind to it, you can do anything, Daphne. Yeah. yeah. Right on. You've got what it takes. Right, guys? Yeah. Yeah? yeah? Yeah. Yeah. yeah! 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 All right! So, did I pass? Like... Did you hear that? Uh, nope. <laughs> Good. Me neither. Did you guys hear that noise? 
<laughs> oh, you mean like that noise? It's the Spectre of Shadow Canyon! Quick, in the Jeep! Shaggy? Where are you guys? Like it coming! Zombies at all. And you aren't soul sucking cat people. <laughs> bravo! Bravo! I really couldn't ask for a better performance. That was amazing. I didn't know you had it in you. Can he do it? Can dead meat save the day? Scooby Dooby Doo! Hey! 
Siege! The dust is clearing now! The bear's out cold! Dead meat wins it! <laughs> Now let's see who this ghost bear really is. Cookie? 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 Uncle Cookie. I'd say you're looking at a net loss. I think I'll raise the stakes. Let's see who's under that mask. Like I've been saying all along, there's no such thing as real vampires. Right, Mr. Van Helsing? Van Helsing? But why? He was trying to save Petite Show Cereceville by staging a series of real live vampire events. Events tied to his latest book, The Bride of the Vampire which I actually read. It's not bad. You really liked it? I said it's not bad. Don't push it. In the last day, I've seen everything I believed turned upside down. Ghosts and demons were real, so I decided to play by that set of rules. What are you saying? I'm saying that rules are rules, and the first rule of the chest of demons is that it can only be opened by the living. Oh, why, that's right. <laughs> yes, it is. It's time we see who this king of demons really is. It... it can't be. I saw you die. an illusion. I was always good with illusions. The magician that tricked the wizard. my own wardrobe. <laughs> Check it out, Scoob! Like it's a carnival of karate! <laughs> the competition this year is fierce. That's Carrie Kilpatrick, the Irish national champion. He's a two-fisted demolition dynamo. Sapphire Sonia. The only thing deadlier than her kick? 
is her beauty. I heard someone stole all the crystal doorknobs at school. My mom and dad say they were missing at the haunted museum, too. Somebody should tell the neckbeard driving that truck to dial it back. <laughs> anymore. Jeez, talk about a lucky break. Not that lucky. Freddy, the monster wouldn't be a lizard. Lizards are ectothermic, whereas this monster is clearly amphibious. Not the time, Velma. Hello, Governor. Care for a sweep of the old chimney, then? <laughs> <laughs> in the way. That's not my sweater. <laughs> Come on, you nefarious nobodies. Let us A-listers show you how to skin a bat. <laughs> <laughs> This wacky race for the mountebank of menace. Is that the Joker? And Penguin. <laughs> <laughs> Cover you. Like he wants 
just a jump from a moving car? Into a moving car. Uh -uh. <laughs> that was fun. Come on, gang. <laughs> machines that way. So ends the world's greatest detective. And what's left of Gotham City will be the criminal underworld to do with as it pleases. Desist with this depraved disintegration, you diabolical despot! The Becking has arrived! Prepare to face the Hammers of Justice! Like, um, what's next? <laughs> Outrageous! Now that's what I call an entrance. More distractions! Jeepers! He's turned into bat villains! What do we do? Someone's supposed to say holy something about now? Oh, um, holy surrounded by bat villains. Not quite. Try holy Custer's last stand, Batman. How are you so good at this? Come on, gang. I'm gonna miss this.
is it, Scoob? Wait, can't you see I'm broadcasting here? <laughs> hey, you're right. Like, I forgot to check the temperature. Oh, better wear your mittens today, folks. It's a chilly 15 degrees below zero out there. <laughs> and like with a 100% chance of snow monsters. Ladies and gentlemen, we interrupt our regularly scheduled program to bring you this special report. Like live as it happens. Hang on, folks. I've just been handed this important bulletin. Like... One monsoor? Like your menu, sir. Here, try a little blush. We'll take it from here, other Cleopatra. Look 
jokes of frying carpet. Way to go, Scoop! Like charge! to be crazy to get in here, but you'd be even crazier to leave. <laughs> Ooh, that's a lot of puddin' puddin'. You weren't going to eat that salad, were you? <laughs> Ivy gets real upset when folks say nice to plants. This? Oh, uh, garnish. Purely decorative. We'll just put it back for the next evil mastermind to enjoy. Zoinks! Like, man, where did that come from? Beats me! Beats you, too! Zoinks! Georgia. Like we're pinned down? We'll have to eat our way out of here. Let's roll. Shag, Scoob. <laughs> like the villains are all out. We know. They're right behind us. We can't let them escape into the city. Everyone out, quickly. You don't have to tell us twice. About that. Look! <laughs> Since my brutal bats were such a hit at the convention, I thought you pathetic people might enjoy my hideous hide howl. <laughs> Attack my beauty. Teach them the true meaning of fear. <laughs> Scooby Doo, run! Okay, that 
was a little strange. I'm Scooby Doo, Dog Wonder. <laughs> Scooby-Doo, you're safe now. It is my greatest honor and privilege to award you fine young adults an honorary appreciation degree for capturing the Manic Minotaur of Mainsley Manor. Shaggy, enough with the comics. Pay attention, we're getting an award. Blue Falcon and Dynamite. <laughs> yeah, uh, do you guys think you could unmask me now? I've been hanging up here all night. This net really chafes in all the wrong places. Sorry there, Mr. Bad Guy. It takes a lot to plan these kind of award ceremonies, apparently. Let's see who's really behind all the computer thefts. Horton McGuggenheim? Yeah, yeah, like big surprise, the geek with the glasses was stealing all the computers. Can we wrap this up now? I suppose you all want to know why I did it. Well, it all started back in my childhood. No, no, we're good. Don't need to know why. <laughs> like, take them away, officers. Thanks for coming. Bye-bye. <laughs> What's the big rush, Shaggy? We got things to do. And places to go. Let me guess. Does this have something to do with you being a comic book geek and a TV addict? Absolutely. I mean, like, no. But we are going to the Comic Con of Palooza. <laughs> Held every July. In the heart of beautiful downtown San Pedro in California, eh? So exciting. <laughs> Hurry. Fred, grab the wheel and let's, like, hit the road. We can't be late, dude.